Good morning, painting nerds. So I wanted to give you a little bit of introduction about our research project that we are going to be working on for the next little bit. So um, what the big idea is, is identifying an artist that you like the art of, identifying a work of art of theirs that you really like, and then collecting information about this artist with help from a Google Slides template that I will be giving to you guys tomorrow on Tuesday. So that will help organize and give you an idea of a direction of what type of Im image is and what type of information we are kind of looking for, okay? So uh, before you're able to pick an artist, okay, um, I want you just to take a look at the art that is there. I'll be posting um, a document that has 75 artists that are pre-approved for this assignment that you guys may research, as well as a link to a site called Google Arts and Culture on their artist page. And that is a really cool site especially the way they have their artist page set up. So you can browse through and be like, oh, I like that painting. And then you're able to look up what the artist is, okay? Keep in mind that that um, Google Arts and Culture site, that is all type of art. So it's not just painters, okay? And you need to pick a painter for this assignment because we're in painting class, okay? Notice the relationship between what we're studying and what we're doing in class, okay? The other thing I want you guys to keep in mind is that there's only one person who can research each artist. So. If I wanted to research Jeff Koons, which you guys can't do because he's a sculptor, so that's why it's my example, okay? So if I wanted to research Jeff Koons, no one else can research that artist. It's just me, okay? Um, so there's going to be, so watch Google Classroom. So when you submit your answer, um, I will be commenting if I notice that someone else submitted the same answer. It's first come, first serve for picking out your artist, okay? And I did make it so that on the question, you're able to change your answer. So make sure you uh, connect with me. Um, if you change your answer, you wanna make sure that that one's okay then. I believe you should be able to see everyone's responses. If not, just let me know and I'll keep you as updated as I can, okay? So those are the big things uh, that I want you guys to know. One is you're picking out an artist today and you're submitting a answer to that question which says which artist are you planning to focus on for this research project and that is what you're going to be turning in before the end of the day tomorrow okay so you have as much time as possible to do collect this research and put together that google slides okay so pick out an artist find a work of art that you really like that's theirs and make sure you're not doing the same artist as someone else because if you don't do I'm not gonna count your assignment, okay? You need to do your own research, okay? If you need some help uh, finding some additional sites to help you as we keep going, I will be throwing a bunch of websites out there to help you, you guys, some good uh, reputable sites, which means credible, which means you can trust what they're going to say, okay? Because Wikipedia is not your best bet. Um, so I will help you in that direction as well, or you can just contact with me directly and I'll help you out in that way. So um, let me know if you have questions. I hope you guys have fun with this because you might find some really interesting stories in art history, some really good stuff there, but you have to go and look in the right place, not Wikipedia. Anyways, so peace out guys. Let me know if I can help in any way.